right guys I'm um, just going to get this uh, FBX imported into 3d code um, now to get this uh, exported out it's the same way as the substance painter um, go to your Z plugin uh, make sure that you have your uh, FBX export import uh, visible selected and your bin as normals and we're going to export uh, make sure that all of your items are visible that you want to export out uh, so there's two there that I've got hidden and they won't export out so let's uh, export that now we're going to export that create an FBX folder uh, export the Templar Sorry. we're going to open up um, a 3D code version uh, 4.9 or higher um, if you've got 4.8 or lower, uh, you'll need to update to the to one of the later versions because um, there was an issue with FBX importing and um, FBX 28 or well, 2019. Um, if you've got a, a lower version of uh, of 3D code, obviously you can go back and uh, change that FBX version within um, within here in ZBrush you can change the FBX version there so which one it will export out as now I'm just using 2019 which is fine for me so in a 3D code uh, 2019 uh, go to um, we want to paint so I'm gonna just uh, open up file um, and go to import model for pixel painting my uh, FBX and import that Templar in. Um, I think we want to um, smooth, keep edges, uh, no subdivision, keep UVs it's from ZBrush. We can rename things there uh, and then just import that in. Um, that'll take a minute to import in, but it should be fine. And if you have uh, the, the issues with uh, it loading into your um, your 3D code version, obviously there we go. Um, there may be something wrong there with the UVs for the belt, unless I've just got the belt selected. But we've got the character in. Now I have no idea how to paint in um, 3D code, and I won't be going over that. I'll just show you how to export it in.